Hey everyone and welcome to this video. Today I'll be showing you a way by which you can import images in SOLIDWORKS and then use these images to make complex models such as car models etc. So for the demonstration of this video I'll be importing a Lexus car image and then I'll build around it and create its symbol. So first of all select a plane on which you want to create this symbol and click on sketch. Go to tools click on sketch tools and sketch picture now you select the picture on which you want to build it so this is the Lexus symbol now uh, first of all disable this log aspect ratio so because the ratio of width to height will be then fixed so suppose you want to have this rectangular regions length to be 1000 mm and the width to be 500 mm then you can type in here and then uh, in order to place it symmetrically about the origin what we'll do is we'll construct a rectangle of similar dimensions around this now make its length to be 1000 mm and width to be 500 mm and double click on this image and then shift this image so that it's symmetrically placed inside this now it basically helps in a way because when you will be creating this elliptical part so the center of the ellipse would be right about this point and then therefore you can just create this ellipse pretty easily now you can just uh, delete this uh, rectangle if you wish to because there is no need of it right now then go to ellipse and make this outer ellipse first then make the inner ellipse as well and then using spleens we will create the cell portion select this and using these handles extend these so that it takes the shape of this L part click on add relation then also fix these ellipse so that these ellipse don't move and then just adjust this screen so that it roughly takes the shape of L and then we'll construct another screen so that this inner part of the L is completed again we'll drag up the handles So the sketch of it, this is done and then we can just exit the sketch and hide this image. Now what we're going to do is simply extrude this symbol so that that Lexus image is created. So go to extrude boss base, select this. click on selected contours and select these parts and then extrude it to whatever dimension you need so there you go the Lexus car symbol gets created 
and this is how by tracing images you can do this so now i'll show you a car model that i had created using these similar techniques so this is my Porsche 911 GTR. Uh, it almost looks the similar model, but I had made this using the same techniques. But uh, for making this 3D model, obviously you will be requiring all the three views, such as the front view, side view, and the top view. So if again we'll see it, uh, the car part. I'll show you all the images first. So as you can see, this is the side image of the Porsche 911 and I'll also show you the front image as well. And then the top part. So by using all these three views, you can make these uh, corresponding parts of your car model. And an important thing is uh, whenever you are making up these car models, you need to use the surfaces option because in order to create these complex contours. You will always basically require, uh, you will always be requiring the surfaces option and therefore that's it. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave comments below and subscribe to the channel if you are bring a lot more great videos ahead. Thanks.